It doesn't get dirtier. It doesn't get more muscular. The Mattel WWE Elite Series 105. Let's unbox it. We're showing everybody's huge packages off here. Right, yeah, perfect. Disappointment is ruining the packaging, and now, and now, what John Cena? like John Cena? No one likes John Cena! I have a great series of interviews. Continue, continue. I have to, I have to know how to share that with you. Cheers, gentlemen. You hear that siren? It's long overdue. The big bad booty daddy, Scott Steiner, is in Mattel WWE Elite Series 105. Finally, both the Steiner brothers have been released as Mattel WWE action figures. This is an elite figure, no less, and that's what it should be for a former WCW champion in Scott Steiner. Looking bigger than ever. Look at him. Look at those big muscles on the back. We love you, Scott. Uh, we're going to crack this one open and take a look at Big Papa Pup. Holler if you hear me. Uh, it doesn't get more classic than the Freakzilla himself, Scott Steiner. And it's great to have him in the Elite line, uh, especially with a modern-ish look right here. Very exciting. Check out these two interchangeable open hand accessories. Here's the Freakzilla himself, Scott Steiner. Look at those freaks. Look at those peaks for the freaks, baby. Look at those big biceps right here, looking good. Muscles, man. It doesn't get more muscular than Mr. Scott Steiner. Nobody can compare who in the modern era has peaks like this freak. I can't think of anyone. You got that removable chain mail here. If you look at it all the way around, it fits just so nicely on this figure. And it comes right off to reveal that incredible bleach blonde hair on Scott Steiner and those big bad booty daddy shades. You gotta take those off because in the ring you don't wrestle with sunglasses on unless you're an idiot, which this man is not. Perfect physique here. You can see he just ripped as heck and he's got those big biceps just as we all know as his most recognizable asset. And this is the big bad booty daddy right here. Or on the back as it says here, Freakzilla in silver print. And he's got those long red tights and just it looks wilder than ever. Look at the S's on the side. Very cool. This was some great gear that he wore around the 2003 era right after the invasion and all that stuff ended and along comes Scott Steiner shocking everybody at the Royal Rumble and uh, just beating up Triple H of course like because why wouldn't you beat up Triple H if you're Scott Steiner you gotta go for it you know you gotta go to the you gotta if you want to be the king you gotta take out the king and so great to see Scott Steiner finally in the Mattel WWE Elite line. Dirty Dominic Mysterio after turning on his poor poor dear old dad here he is, looking angrier than ever. Uh, perhaps someone that's ready to go to jail? You never know. Uh, but we're gonna crack him open. This is a version of Dom in Judgment Day. All we've seen for a Mattel WWE figure so far is a version of Dom that uh, tags with his father. But this is a, a straight up real Dom Dom right here. Exactly who we're looking for. Uh, the bad boy of wrestling right here. A couple of hand accessories, including with some tattoos here. Here's Dirty Dom, angry as ever. Look at that mullet style haircut, just uh, a haircut that everybody seems to dislike except Dom himself, and that's all right, because you rock the style of hair that you want. Here's the Judgment Day shirt, it's a black shirt with a Judgment Day logo in front, in white, and it has Velcro in the back because it's 100% removable. Remove that shirt, you can see Dom's gear, and on the back you got the DM for Dominic Mysterio in the front, black and purple, those arm tattoos. He's looking like he's done some time right here. This is the man doing some time. Dominic Mysterio with those uh, tributes perhaps on his legs. I'll leave that up to you. And in front of his boots right here, some Judgment Day symbols. And of course, these are tall kick pads because that's how he likes to wrestle. And he wrestles how he wants to wrestle. Dominic Mysterio, long awaited uh, Dom Dom version. Hey, hey, straight out of the Red Hot Women's Division, here's EO Sky shocking the universe with a SummerSlam win as part of damage control. Check that out. There she goes. Wide open. And ready to win some more? Mm, I think so. A couple of interchangeable gloved hand accessories here. And of course, shiny gold like brand new with a white strap. The WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. For a Women's Tag Team Champion. 
Here's a look at the figure itself. EO Sky, all smiles. I love the half braided, half straight hair. Uh, pretty cool uh, type uh, wrestler specific look right there, right? You wouldn't really see that anywhere else uh, because only wrestlers can pull off cool things sometimes. You got these arm braces here, uh, some gloved hands on the other side as well. Uh, black and white ring top with uh, some molded ruff right there. And on the back, see those straps, black and white. Uh, you see the molded belt in the front right here, very cool. Uh, even on the side here, this kind of flips up, gold and black. Uh, just an overall great design. Uh, a lot of thought gone under this ring gear and gone into the action figure to detail it. As you can see on the back, yellow and white, yellowish kind of. It's like a darker yellow, so pretty cool. The studs are painted on, nice tall kick pad boots, and we're ready to defend. Our tag team gold right here with Eo Sky. Johnny Wrestling, clap, 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 clap. Johnny Gargano right here, back in the Mattel WWE Elite line. Uh, finally, after all this time, the last time was a fan takeover figure. So imagine how exciting it is to see him make it back in the line right here with that little uh, kind of emoji vest look that he's got. There it is in real life, and here it is in figure form. So we're gonna crack it open and see what Johnny Wrestling has to offer right here. A couple of hand accessories, one with a ring on the hand and the other an open hand. Here's the Johnny Wrestling figure himself, uh, searching out into the crowd for his peeps maybe? Oh no, just for his fans probably, that's all right. He's got that black vest with the silver uh, one eye closed emoji right there. And these straps of course come off. As you can see, here's the back of it. Uh, cool wrist tape too, black, yellow, and blue on this side and black, yellow, and red on this side right here. Here goes Johnny Wrestling, ready for a match. Check out those trunks, very cool. Uh, the cityscape in the front, kind of kind of neat with that emoji symbol. Johnny Gargano, oh, on his knee pad too. Check that out right there. Uh, we're getting ahead of ourselves because here's Johnny Wrestling on the back of the trunks with in white and yellow, a couple of polka dots there. Great color scheme on this ring gear, very cool, very unique. You know, it doesn't seem to be based off like uh, anything too complicated. Uh, it looks like a kind of an original design, and that's why I like it. Uh, you can see right here the other knee pad with some dots and more uh, buildings in the front of his boots right there. Uh, a towering type of ring gear for a towering type of wrestler in Johnny Wrestling, Johnny Gargano. Roar! Bring out the choo-choo train noises. Braun Strowman is back into the Mattel. Roar! Bring out the choo-choo train noises. Braun Strowman is back in the Mattel WWE Elite line. Here's this big old dude uh, that's going to give these hands to whoever gets in his way back in the Mattel WWE Elite line. Braun Strowman, one of the biggest, most intense looking dudes ever, and here he is right there going for it. A couple of interchangeable hand accessories here. And finally, the moment you've all been waiting for, the monster among men. The monster of all monsters, just like it says on the shirt, Braun Strowman makes a return to the Mattel WWE Elite line. Now you wanna know one thing that impresses me about this figure kind of more than anything else? It's not this big bushy beard right here. It's the bald head folds. Check those out. You gotta love when there's bald head folds on a figure. Excellent. When that shirt comes off, you get a good look at his tattoos. You can see it here on the shoulder right there. Some black wrist tape. And here's those red ring pants with a black belt right here. And you got some rips right here in the ring pants. Very cool. Gotta love that. Also on the knee pads, kind of a ripped style. Uh, and black right here and completely ripped through above that. And some short black boots with some laces on it. On the back, nothing. Just straight up red ring pants, because that's all you need is straight up red ring pants when you're the monster of all monsters like Braun Strowman, especially with bald head folds like this. And now we're ready to go for it because we got Carmelo Hayes, Mellow Don't Miss, baby. Uh, a absolute standout on the NXT roster, uh, catapulting to superstardom under the watchful eye of Shawn Michaels and other NXT coaches and trainers. And you know, the future, it's nowhere but up for this guy right here. Uh, this is somebody that, oh look, he's got the variant too, Chase variant with uh, purple ring gear and red ring gear. So we're going to take a look at both of those for this uh, locker room leader ultimately. And trust me, nobody knows that this guy is a locker room leader more than I know. And that's all I'm going to say. Alright Carmelo, 
Let's keep, let's, let's watch it and see what you can give us. Show us something good. Show us something good besides your first Mattel WWE action figures. He's already showing it. He's already showing it. Mellow don't miss, right? Both figures come with a set of interchangeable hands right here. A pair of removable sunglasses right there. Check that out. And that cloth black entrance jacket. So cool. So soft. What a soft good right there. Looking good. And you got not one, but two versions of Carmelo, Mellow Don't Miss Haze right here. Look at that head sculpt. Looking like he's ring ready right there. He got that little soul patch going. The mustache, the hair, the man bun at the top. I know a lot of people with man buns like that, man, but he wears it well. Look at that. Accurate tattoos right here. You can see that. And this is a ripped man. This is a man that has put a lot of time and effort into his physique and it shows, especially in action figure form. Uh, even more so on TV though, let's be honest here. You got either uh, red short tights right here with the C and H on the side for Carmelo Hayes, of course. Uh, or you have the purple style right here. Uh, and this one has symbols on the side. So not a C or an H here, but some designs right there, you know? Very cool. And gold. Get a good look at that. See the rest of it right here on the knee pads right there. Check that out, more of the same design. And all the way up his kick pads. Uh, dope boots, great ring gear in the purple style. And don't forget the red style because we got an A and a broken heart right there. Champ, mellow on the front of the kick pads. Uh, just another great design. You can't go wrong uh, with a look like this, you know? Classic but modern. And that's what Carmelo Hayes is as a wrestler, very clearly. Who, if Undertaker's gonna give you a stamp of approval, you are classic but modern. And that's what's going on here with Carmelo Hayes in Mattel WWE Elite Series 105. And that's about the size of it. Mattel WWE Elite Series 105, ready to ship straight to your door from ringside collectibles. Braun Strowman, the monster of all monsters, the monster among men, back in the Mattel WWE Elite line and with head folds. Uh, you got EO Sky right here, defending her tag team gold, her women's tag team championship gold. Dom Dom Mysterio, uh, slowly but surely turning into the uh, prison Dom badass that he is right there. And Johnny Gargano, Johnny Wrestling, returning to the Mattel WWE Elite line. Uh, speaking of returning, what about a debut for Scott Steiner in Mattel WWE Elite Series 105? One of the longest, longest awaited legends finally here for your Mattel WWE Elite Collection. And speaking of another debut, Carmelo Hayes coming straight out of the gate with not one, but two versions for what's absolutely going to be a future standout in professional wrestling. Head on over to Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigures.com. You can get all these Mattel WWE Elite figures. You can get uh, wrestling rings, accessories, any other type of wrestling action figure you can think of. Uh, all kinds of things. Check us out, Ringside Collectibles, WrestlingFigures.com. You should already know to make it all about wrestling figures.